Okay, so I'm sure a lot of you all are getting frustrated on how to use the Microsoft Surface Pen and uh, the thicknesses um, on OneNote. And OneNote's a great tool. Um, I use it all the time. I use it in college. Now it's 2022 and they have the ability to do so much more. But I wanted to show you guys something that's, I'm sure it's frustrating and I just want to teach you that so say you want to like write with your pen and there's a specific thickness uh, that uh, is generated by OneNote. So I actually changed my one click to this is the video here and I have a file. And uh, if you're looking, oops, take a look here. See the thickness? Well, everyone says, oh, well, you just go down here and you go to your uh, Microsoft thing and you type in pen. And then from pen, you go to the ink settings, right? And then from ink settings, it says, um, there we go, focus. Uh, we're talking about like the the pen itself. I'm left-handed, so we set it up for left-handedness. And then we, you know, pair. And But where does it show you the actual thickness? And every video I've seen online does not talk about this. So I want to quickly just show you how to do this. And this is going to fix a lot of frustration here. So get out of this menu, all right? Perfect. And uh, you can see the thickness here, thickness. For, forgive the sloppiness. I'm writing in a kickstand position, which I typically write down, but the best way to share this is uh, by displaying it on its kickstand. So what I wanna show you is, believe it or not, if you come here and you type in Surface, just type in the word Surface, right? And Surface Apps is going to pop up. You want to click Surface Apps. All right. That's going to pull up your actual Surface, right? Um, and then it's also going to pull up like your, your Pro and all this stuff. And, you know, you could click on here and talk about smart charging and learn more about your device. Sorry about this. This is acting weird. But what you really want to do is scroll down here to the Surface Pen. And then the pen comes back, right? And then you want to go to pressure settings. This is it. This is exactly what you need. You see that heart? If you change this thickness, it directly correlates to the thickness here. See that thickness? Same pressure. Um, again, my T. See that? And if you take this and you turn it all the way down, it gets really light. So I know like there's settings here for favorite, you know, pen one, two, etc. It's been really frustrating to determine the millimeter on what consistency, like what you want to write with. This is how you do it. You go to the Surface app, you go down to the bottom, you click on pen, and I think I keep mine right at like five, I believe. There's a number down here, five. And you could clear this and then just do a test and this is how it's gonna look. You could probably do a four and get away with it. Um, I think I'm a four. Yeah, no, I, I, like, I like number five because it provides just a little bit more boldness. But anything more than a five for me is too much. Um, yeah, five it is. So that's how you do it. Hope all is well. Wanted to keep this video under, you know, three minutes. Bye.